What's up gorgeous people? It's Amber. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a 50 style dress haul. So fun. Like I have mentioned on a couple of my videos how I love these 50 style dresses and I was really hoping that the Amazon stylist would kind of pick up on my drift of which ones I really liked because I first saw these on Amazon. They had great polka dot ones and like sunflower ones. They were so cute and I was just thinking mm, I would really like the, to you know try one of those but I'm like what size do I actually need? Do I need a small? Do I need a medium? I really wasn't sure so I was just kind of hoping that maybe the stylist would send me one of those so I could try before I buy. Well, that didn't happen. <laughs> so I just went on my own and decided that I was just going to buy some. I found three of the ones that I'm going to show you today on eBay and two from Sheen. So those are the uh, sites that I found the best deal on these. So I just kind of went for it and I uh, was hoping fingers crossed that I got the right size. I went with the medium because as I always say, it's much easier to take something in than it is to like add fabric and try to figure out how you're going to fix something that's too small. So that is what we're going to do today. And I just want to note, aren't these earrings fabulous? Oh my gosh, living for the earrings. They were a bonus that one of the sellers on eBay gave me with one of my shoe hauls. Thank you, Reina. If you are watching, thank you so much. Living for the earrings. They are so cute and they go perfect with the shirt that I just got from Sheen. So just wanted to throw that in there. <laughs> At any rate, now that I've derailed the intro, let's get into this wonderful 50s style dress haul. Okay, guys, here's my first dress. Oh, so fun. So comfortable, so light, so airy. Yeah, and I'm just going to, full disclosure, warn you guys ahead of time, there's going to be a lot of polka dots in this haul. I'm obsessed with polka dots. Not sure what the unhealthy obsession with polka dots is, but uh, yeah, there's going to be quite a few polka dots coming up soon. At any rate, this one here is so cute. Fits me really good. Really easy to get on because... It zips all the way down so that you can just slide it over your body. So that's really awesome, right? I mean, this is so cute. I love the button detail here on the corners of the collar. And then we have buttons going down here and then into this fun striped little piece here. So I love this. This is so light, so airy. Woo! This is a really cute dress. I mean, I even like where it's hitting me right below the knee. Totally fine with that. You put a pair of heels with this. Maybe some bright yellow ones, perhaps those delicious ones that I just made <laughs> will look good with this. But yeah, loving this. I don't have to layer up. It fits me perfect. I don't have to put a shirt underneath. Loving it. This is awesome. Let's move on to the next dress. Okay, guys, here's my next one. Oh, 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 oh. My gosh, I am like screaming. I love this one. I mean, this one is just hitting me so good. I feel so good in this one. This makes me feel beautiful. Honestly, this is so awesome. Okay. So obviously I have a little clip here, but what I'm thinking is this will be very difficult for me to get on and off if I tack this down with my sewing machine. So what I will probably do here is I might add like a little snap button or something like that. Um, I just, I tried the fashion tape and that didn't work. Maybe because the fashion tape was from the Dollar Tree, perhaps. I don't know. But I think if maybe I put like a little snap button here, that will solve that situation. Otherwise, this is fitting me so good. Oh my gosh, I love this. I mean, I love this. You can wear it with or without the belt. That was a weird little pose there. But anyways, uh, you can wear it with or without the belt. I think it looks so much better with the belt. I just love the drama of it. But look at how this is hitting me. Look at how this is flowing. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. And the collar, it's like a wide collar and comes out here. The sleeves are hitting me just right. And on the back, it has like, I hope you guys can hear me, but it has like these gathers right here in the back of it. Oh my gosh, it is just so cute. And it's hitting me really good from the back. I love this one. This is one of my favorite ones so far. I mean, oh my gosh, I can't wait to wear this. There's so many possibilities with accessories. You could go bright yellow. You could go bright pink. I mean, there's just so many options. Of course, red is an option. Looks good with polka dot. I don't know. The options are endless. I love this one. This one is hitting me perfect. Medium was clearly the right size. I'm living for this. Can't wait to have a place to wear it too. Maybe I'll go back into the office soon. Maybe I won't. But I'm telling you what, it's worth going in just to wear this dress. <laughs> so yeah, this is pretty awesome. 
awesome. I'm really excited. But um, yeah, let's move on to the next dress, even though I don't want to take this one off. <laughs> let's move on to the next one. Okay, guys, here's my next dress. This one is so cute. This is actually the first one that I've seen of these, and this is what attracted me to want to buy these. Um, unfortunately, this one is not fitting me the way that it should, which is why I have the trusty clips here on the side. So, uh, easy fix though, because it fits me everywhere else. Everywhere else is great. I mean, this is really comfortable. It's fitting me good, but the issue is uh, up here. So what I'll do is I'll just see how, uh, let me get closer. See how there's a seam right here. I will just seam wrap that out and then I will just take this up to where I need it to right through my sewing machine. Easy fix. So this is definitely an easy fix. I'm really excited for it though. It's so cute. We have the red with the polka dots. We got some buttons on the front. And here's your back. Pretty basic on the back. But uh, the front is obviously the best part. So I should have mentioned on the other one that I just showed you, these ones zip, this one and the other one zips on the side. So I have to put these ones over my head to get them on, but they're still really easy to get on and everything. But um, yeah, I like the one that I could unzip all the way and just kind of slide it over to my body. That's just easier to put on, clearly. But uh, yeah, I mean, these ones are great too. They're easy to put on and off. They got the zippers on the side. So I mean, they're good, but I would just like to not have to put them over my head, especially when I'm filming a video. Video where I'm trying to stay looking somewhat decent while I film it. <laughs> so at any rate, this one's also a win-win. I will make this small adjustment to the sleeves and I will definitely uh, do a tutorial showing you guys how I do that so that if you have this issue with any of your dresses, you can make the same easy fix. So this is so far going really well. Let's move on to the next dress. Okay, guys, here's my next dress. So this is so cute too. Uh, yeah, we're back to the polka dots again. Like I told you, there's going to be lots of polka dots. So we have black and white polka dots with some sunflowers I think they're supposed to be on the dress. So cute. Yes. It's definitely different from what I normally wear because I don't wear a lot of white, but I really loved this one. I just like the print on this one. So I went ahead and went for it. I had a little trouble figuring out how I was going to tie this little thing. Um, I don't know. I'll figure that out and play with it some more. But otherwise, this is fitting me like a glove. Oh my gosh, I love this one. It seems like all the ones that I got from the eBay seller are like dead on for me as far as fit goes and... Um, they're easier to put on because they this one zips up the back too. So you just slide it over your body and zip it up. Really easy for me to get on and off by myself with no help. So I like that a lot. Um, they also offered the ones that I bought from Sheen, but I had already bought them from Sheen is why I didn't buy them from the seller. So um, I'm not sure if their zipper closures would be exactly the same as the ones on Sheen, most likely where they zip on the side or if they'll go up the back. I really don't know because I didn't buy them from them. But uh, yeah, these are so affordable too, guys. They're so light and airy. Now, as far as the quality of the fabric goes, I mean, you have to figure you're paying like $12 for a dress. So don't be expecting top quality on these. But for me, they're totally fine because, you know, I'm a cheap person. So this feels great to me. <laughs> but somebody else might be like, okay, the fabric's junk, whatever. So I just want to throw that disclosure out there. Should you decide to buy these from the seller that I got them from? I feel like the quality is fine. I feel like they're well made. But somebody who buys better clothes than I do would probably have a different opinion. So here's the back of it. So cute. Oh my gosh, this is fitting me like a glove. I just love going like this with these dresses. Ah, they're just so cute. Yeah, I am living for them. So I have one more dress for you guys and then we're going to close out this video. Okay, guys, here's my last dress. Oh my gosh, I am living, 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 living for this dress. Ah, it's so cute. Okay, so obviously we're revisiting the polka dot thing again, but it's purple. Oh my gosh, I love this one. This one is hands down my favorite, but let's address the obvious issue. This t-shirt underneath, not feeling that. That totally takes away from the dress. And plus this is kind of a crusty white t-shirt, but it's the only one I could find. It's not exactly white anymore. So it's really taking away from how great this dress is. Look at these two buttons here. I love the way this is uh, set up here at the top with this little... I don't know what you want to call this. It's not really, I guess it's like a sweetheart neckline, but uh, I like how they put like a collar here, the black collar, loving that. Now this one ties around the back, see? 
So it ties around the back like that. Really not a fan of dresses that do that. So here's my fix. <laughs> I am going to take these two straps or these two pieces of ribbon that you would normally tie together and I'm just gonna take them and I'm going to turn them into straps. Yes, ma'am. It's exactly gonna be my fix for this. So I'll just find, you know, the right spot uh, where they should be and then I'm gonna make sure they hit where my bra strap hits and then I don't need to wear anything underneath fixing all the problems with this. So because I'm not a fan of the tie around, I mean, I, this would look adorable on somebody who is comfortable just wearing this tied around like that with no bra or a strapless bra. Let me rephrase that a strapless bra or whatever, but uh, I'm not that girl. So I am going to have a DIY on this where I just take these two pieces of ribbon, find the right place, attach them to the back here and make them straps. So that's going to totally solve my situation with this because this one was my favorite, is my favorite. Love the way that it fits. Everything is fitting perfectly. It looks so nice on me. I absolutely love these dresses. I just feel so pretty wearing them. So I highly suggest getting them from the seller. But again, if you like extremely expensive fabrics, this is not your seller. But if you like something that's really cute, light for summer and spring, this is your seller. I love these. These are so cute. Let's jump into my final thoughts. Okay, guys, so that was a huge success, right? This was exactly what I was talking about when I was trying so very hard to let the Amazon stylist know that I really wanted these 50 style dresses that had the wonderful fun prints. And I saw these on Amazon first, so I know they have them, and I just don't understand how they weren't picking up what I was putting down. Maybe if there was a way for me to provide a link that would have helped them, I don't know. Uh, or maybe it's possible that there are certain brands and things that they're supposed to choose from for the Amazon stylist. I'm not really sure. Maybe that was the case. At any rate, they just were not sending what I was looking for. So when I saw these ones on eBay for such a great price, I'm like, how can I pass this up? Worst case scenario, it becomes a DIY and I make it so that it will fit. But going with a medium was obviously the right choice because they fit me so good. But uh, I definitely was not going to go with a small in this case because I just in case they didn't fit, it is so much easier. And I said this in my intro, it is so much easier to take something in than it is to try to figure out what fabric you're going to add to it if it's too small. So that is definitely a rule of thumb. <laughs> if you are ever looking at something, you're not sure what size to get. If you are handy with a sewing machine and you're able to take it in, definitely always size up instead of getting the smaller size and then having to try to figure out how you're going to fix it or you have to send it back. So I don't know, just a little uh, rule of thumb that I always go by. But overall, this was a very successful haul. I mean, I'm definitely going to get some more from that seller on eBay because they had lots of other fun styles uh, listed. But again, I was just kind of picking and choosing and trying different ones um, that I thought would work for me. And I wasn't sure of my size. So I wasn't going to just, you know, like buy the whole thing, which is possible that could happen at some point because they're so affordable. And they're so freaking cute. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna go back in with the seller on eBay and buy some more from them. And I have linked them in the description box below if you're interested in these types of dresses. And I also linked in the description box below the ones that I got from Sheen, but I cannot promise you guys that they're still going to be available. So if they're not available, I won't link them. But if they are still available, I will link them in the description box below for you. But they also sell these exact same ones that I got from Sheen on eBay and on Amazon. So I'll provide those links as well. If you're willing to pay a little bit more money, you can still get that same dress just from a different place, but it's the exact same dress. I saw both of those styles on eBay and Amazon. So if the Sheen one isn't available, maybe you can jump on one of those sites. But at any rate, I'm really excited with this haul. I'm very pleased with this haul. This is so my style. I'm so excited. Can't wait to wear this stuff. Should I ever present myself in public again? <laughs> Which at this point, guys, I don't know when that's going to be. So hopefully soon, but you know, we're just rolling with the punches here, but I have a lot of fabulous things to wear whenever that happens. <laughs> so I hope that you found this video helpful or useful in some way, if not, at least entertaining in some way. <laughs> if you did, please hit that subscribe button, click the notification bell, like, share, do all those things to help other people find this channel. Thanks so much for taking the time to check this out and I will catch you in my next video. Just people, what was that? Wah! Wah! <laughs> Again, <laughs> because I
I got some of the dresses on eBay and I got a couple of the dresses from Sheen and it was actually from that most recent Sheen haul that I did where this shirt came from. Isn't it fabulous? <laughs> I love this shirt. At any rate, um, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> Shocker. So I have been talking about how I just love these 50 style dresses and I was just kind of hoping one of the stylists from Amazon would be, um, would be what? <laughs> Let's think and do it again. What's up gorgeous people? It's Amber. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a 50 style, that message that just came on my phone threw me off. <laughs> What's up, gorgeous people? It's Amber. Welcome. I, I like took a deep breath. Like, <gasps> I gotta do it again. Wow. Rough. But I found such a great deal. It wouldn't have been a huge tragedy if I got the wrong size. Let's say even if, you know, let uh, yeah. My nose is itchy <laughs> again. Okay, guys. Here's the next one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this fashion tape from Dollar Tree ain't working. 